This is Mike with Integrity Home Inspections. I'm at 11535 Southeast Stephen Street, Portland, Oregon, conducting the sewer scope inspection. I'm going to clean out on top of the roof up to the city main line in the street.
We're just over 86 feet. We reach the city lateral and continue to push the line. Here about 101 feet from the roof vent on the roof, we've reached the city main line. I'm going to pause the video, turn off the water, allow the line to drain, and then I'll resume the video and start pulling back the camera and further inspect the line. It does appear to be a little bit of a belly here, uh, but in my opinion, it doesn't appear to be too significant in length so far, um, although it really technically shouldn't be here at all. Um, but actually, more of the further I'm kind of bringing the camera back, uh, the more it looks like you know it's a little worse than what I first thought. Uh, but again, I mean, it doesn't appear to be too bad. Uh, there's a little bit of standing water, you know, um, and the lines really shouldn't. Have any water in them at all um, once we turn the water off inside the home um, but in my opinion that most likely won't affect the sewer line too much at all
So here about seven feet in, this is where it connects from the cast iron to the ABS plastic. So it uh, looks like most of the line's been replaced um, besides this little last section of cast iron. You can tell there's some surface erosion throughout the line and um, eventually this, this portion of the cast iron line uh, is going to need to be replaced as well. Um, you can tell there's some clogging and that sorts of stuff which I think is causing a little bit of this backup right here, this clog right here is causing this water to kind of sit in the line and uh, wherever water sits in cast iron eventually it could just erode through the bottom portion of the line so this concludes the sewer scope video inspection um, Really the biggest concerns with the sewer line, in my opinion, are uh, that small bellied section inside the plastic sewer line. Uh, it appeared to be about four to five feet long at most, um, but there's a real, really a minimal amount of standing water, maybe a quarter to a half an inch of water, and it's inside a plastic line, so I really don't think that should impact the sewer line too much. Um, although, again, uh, the sewer line technically should completely drain uh, when the water is turned off inside the home. Uh, also, uh, the last six feet or seven feet of cast iron that's underneath the home, uh, eventually that's going to need to be replaced. It looks like there was a little bit of a clog there, uh, causing some water to kind of back up into the line. So uh, maybe just recommend running a lot of water or maybe even a jetting of the sewer line to clear all that out to make sure that it doesn't get worse or um, the water doesn't continue to just to sit there and erode away the line. Um, I'll put this all throughout the report and email the report along with the video inspection to the agent and buyers. Thank you for choosing integrity and have a good day.